Same as North Germany. Once again, no quorum in the Capitol as the GOP's walkout continues into day five now. They're protesting a single controversial bill aimed to reduce carbon emissions. It's something they say that should be up to the voters, but Democrats say it's been put off long enough. Fox 12's Amber Wilmarth is in Salem with how they're now taking legal action against the Republican representatives as other bills are stalled. Amber? Pete, we were on the Senate floor here at the Capitol this morning, where as for a fifth day, there weren't enough lawmakers inside to continue with their work. Now other pending bills are piling up, including one that may result in longer lines at the DMV this summer. This was the Senate floor Friday morning, as once again, there was no quorum. Same as North Germany. Nearly all Senate and House Republican lawmakers are boycotting the Capitol over a cap-and-trade carbon emissions bill. We're told they're not coming back unless the bill is either killed or referred to voters. Senate President Peter Courtney spoke briefly before they adjourned for the day. I do not understand human beings that leave after the first half. I don't understand it. To me, you wear the uniform, you wear the uniform. You may not agree that you don't need to work. With this session ending next week, other bills are in jeopardy, including a request by the DMV for additional staffing as they begin to issue real IDs this July. The DMV spokesperson says this proposal will allow them to open a few offices on Saturdays to issue real IDs by appointment. He says while they already have approval to hire 40 more staff members, this day would help alleviate the large crowds they're anticipating. But only three bills have passed the House and Senate this session, and at this rate, that could be the extent of it. The Senate Republican leader says they're prepared to boycott through the end of the session. And just yesterday, the House Rules Committee chair filed a subpoena for House Republicans to return here next Thursday to testify about their, quote, unexcused absences. Reporting live in Salem, Amber Wilmarth, Fox 12, Oregon.